Hello everyone, welcome back to another session by K21 Academy. Today our expert trainer will be discussing about application services. So let's get into the video. So let's quickly begin the application services. So AWS provide different managed application services to coordinate between your distributed applications. So we do not work in an environment where we do not have, you know, we uh, everything is there on a single system. We have always a distributed and a decoupled environment which are more easier to manage, which are more e easy to scale, which are more easy to rectify. These are the, the benefits that we are getting out of a distributed applications. That is the reason nowadays more and more people are more inclined towards an environment where we have decoupled applications. We have distributed applications which are working for us. So there are um, services by Amazon which helps us to create and maintain and work with these kind of distributed applications and these services that are available is SES, SNS, SQS and SWS. So when I say distributed application that means I have an application there are multiple modules working in that particular application. So suppose say for an instance, I have an credit card uh, transaction which is happening for me. So I have an e-commerce website on which I am purchasing some component. So when I create an application, what all I have to do is I have to have a, you know, a system created to publish my product. So I have, I need to have a system to catalog my product. I need a system to do that. I need a system where my user can make his account and can maintain what he has done in the past and what what is the kind of order that he's creating. So user management is the one task that I have to do with this particular application of e-commerce that I'm looking for. I need to do a vendor management on the application because people will be selling something and people will be purchasing something. So apart from catalog, customer management or user management i need to also do the vendor management and when somebody is purchasing anything i may have to pay via paypal i need to may pay via paytm i can even pay via the cards bill desk and all those you know uh, integrations has to be maintained so the transaction related module has to be created then there will be a module in which the system storage will be happening so i need to have different modules working for myself now if i put everything on a single and platform it becomes very difficult for me to manage the things if i have to do any changes on one system it has to be done uh, like all the systems will suppose say there is a you know uh, some patch upgrade or some uh, application upgrade at happening at for the catalog product management that i am doing so i have to bring down the whole system do the upgrade for this particular or management or if there is a problem in this particular system all these will be impacted all together so that is the reason we put all these various various parts of the application and on in a distributed environment so they will be working independently and will be transacting and communicating with each other so this is known as a distributed application or a decoupled environment so for this distributed environment or a decoupled environment or a distributed application we need to set up a communication between them then only a task done by this will be communicated to this and the output of this particular task can be an input to this particular module of mine right so i should have a system where my these different different modules or you can say a distributed application can communicate with each other so as to perform the task for the end user or you can say the task suppose the e-commerce task has to be done so that that task should be done so although the modules are different they are separate independent but they communicate with each other so as to achieve the desired result this is known as a distributed application or a decoupled environment i need some services to coordinate between these distributed applications where multiple modules are there and they need to coordinate with each other so i have got these services by amazon ses that is simple email service sns that is simple notification service sqs that is simple queuing service or you can say simple queue service and 
a simple workflow service so these are the multiple service or you can say application services available in the kitty of amazon which helps you to work with the distributed or decoupled environments so guys this was our expert from team k21 academy and if in case you missed upon any concept or if you want to dive deeper into the concepts then we have something really special for you we have our free class on amazon aws solution architect certification for beginners under this free class you'll be learning about why and who should learn aws cloud services deployment models and aws services as well and the most important part is you'll be getting hands-on labs job opportunities along with docker and kubernetes in aws and amazing amazing stuff so if you want to register for this free class all you have to do is just log on to your browser and type k21academy.com forward slash aws sa02 and after that you'll be seeing this kind of interface you just have to click on book your free seat now select your event date add your name your email address your phone number and click on yes save my seat and after that you'll be seeing this kind of page you just have to save this link on the extreme right add it to your calendars and i'll see you in the free class till then keep learning